everyone, hope you're doing well. I'm Sarkis, and since you guys enjoyed last week's two in one home theater video, today we're touring not one, not two, but three rooms. I said to myself, why not? Oh, they are unique and different, and there's a bit of something for everyone. But please, please, please remember it's not a competition. We're not going to compare rooms, price tags, what's right and wrong. Let's just enjoy these awesome, awesome rooms and please show some love and click on that thumbs up button. I hope you inspire some of you guys for your own rooms and personally, there is nothing better than chilling out and watching these amazing home theater and gaming tours. Now before we start, if you're into general tech, home theater, PC and gaming, hit that subscribe button and share these videos. And as always, if you see anything you like, I'll have everything listed for you in the description box down below, so check them out. If you want your room to be featured, as you guys will see, they're not state-of-the-art theaters. They're affordable, minimal, and I'm sure a lot of you guys are going to enjoy it. So don't be shy, shoot me a message on Instagram, message me on my Discord channel or an email, which I will list in the description for you guys. Enough talking. We've got to get through three rooms and let's take a look at room number one. So the first room we're checking out belongs to Pratik Gulati from Melbourne, Australia. Pratik moved into his new house in May 2019. His 4 meter by 5 meter space was initially designed as an open area but he chose to create a dedicated home theater room to enjoy with his family, which was a dream of his for many many years. His room features a full 5.2.4 Klipsch surround sound setup and starting in the front we have the reference series Klipsch RP6000F floor standing speakers which of course look fantastic. For his center channel he's chosen the premium Klipsch RP500C center speaker which is equipped with the all new Venta tweeter designed for a smoother high frequency reproduction. Moving on to the back of the room, we have the Klipsch RP402 surround speakers on either end of the back wall facing towards the front of the room. These speakers not only look awesome, but they also transform your movies into a completely immersive home theater experience. Up above in the ceiling, we have four Klipsch CS18C Dolby Atmos custom series speakers for that overhead immersive experience. These come with the white magnetic grills and blend in very nicely with the room's decor. Finishing his setup, he's hooked up the Klipsch SPL120 subwoofer on one side of the room and another Jammer SW505E subwoofer on the other side. Pratik plans to replace these two subs with the famous SVS PB16 Ultras in the near future. That should be very interesting and I cannot wait for updated photos. His complete surround sound is being powered by the Marantz 6014 9 channel 4K receiver. Now this is a fine example of a affordable, high quality unit featuring HDR10 and IMAX enhanced technology and pump at 110 watts per channel. Pratik also plans to add another Marantz 2 channel amplifier to add two more Klipsch RP600M bookshelf speakers to his setup. Now moving on to the screens and projection, he's using the 130-inch 16.9 ratio screen technique screen which enhances your home theater experience with premium resolution technology and state-of-the-art optical structure. If any of you guys are in the market to one of these, make sure you check these out. Matching his high-quality screen, he's using the Epson EHTW9400 4K projector which seems like a lot of people choose this option and I think it's because he offers features like 4K Pro Ultra HD HDR processor, lens memory, and a powered lens shift for a very affordable price. Around the room, Pratik has kept it minimal and clean, which is refreshing and modern. I like this awesome looking light he has in the corner, it gives it a unique touch to the room, and these electric reclining seats look super comfortable. Up above for lighting, they might look like down lights, but they're actually LYFX lights which change colors and create a cool effect to the room. He also plans to add a huge velvet curtain to cover the window on the side of the room. And Pratik is very strict with his room and that's why he has a man cave rule poster that must be followed or else you'll be kicked out or even banned for good. If you guys have any questions for Pratik, please comment in the section below. But for now, let's check out room number two. 
This beautiful room belongs to Paolo Boccaglia from Milan, Italy, who lives in a small apartment and space was always his enemy, but he managed to turn his living room into a high-end mini 5.1 home theater. So let's check it out. Now, I don't know about you guys, but the first thing that catches my eyes are these amazing looking White Pylon Audio Jasper 25 floor standing front left and right speakers. They are amazing. These modern, sexy, curvaceous loudspeakers from Pylon Audio will wow you with both their looks and sound. They are really special, featured with two 18 midwoofers and designed for out of this world crystal clear audio. For you audiophile fanatics out there, he's also using the Van der Hull Magnum Hybrid speaker cables and amplifier surgery silver plated RCA interconnect audio cables. For his center channel, he's using the two-way acoustic suspension Yamaha NSC44 speaker, which is semi-hidden behind the 65-inch Samsung 4K HDR QLED TV, and he streams most of his movies and TV shows via Netflix and Apple TV. Paula plans to rearrange his home theater setup and upgrade his rear speakers, which is currently the Wall Mountain Indiana Line Nano 2.0 speakers. And for those big booms, he's hooked up the affordable and high quality Valodyne VLF 810 subwoofer, which offers outstanding clarity. If any of you autophile fanatics are after a subwoofer and don't want to break the bank, this one's it. This amazing setup is being powered by the 7 channel Denon AVRX 3300W full 4K Ultra HD receiver. This baby pumps out about 180 watts per channel driven. It's got all your bells and whistles such as 8 HDMI outputs, Dolby Atmos, AirPlay and DSD slash WAV support for high resolution audio streaming for those hi-fi enthusiasts. And of course, finishing it off with these two awesome components, the Kinky Studio EXM1 and the Kinky Studio Vision DAC1. These two guys will make your foot tap to their supremely confident, rhythmic and dynamic presentation. They are the star of the show, and as you guys can see in this living room, they look fantastic with those pylon speakers. Behind the TV, Apollo has also installed some 15 cm thick rock wall panels for some acoustic treatment and overall this room looks cozy, modern and has plenty of natural lighting which is refreshing. Yes, it's a small room with a big sound but it works for him and it's a space he created to be enjoyed with his family. If anyone has any questions for him, shoot a comment down below and once again I will try to list some of these components for you guys so if you're interested, check them out. And let's check out our final room. This final room belongs to Aslak Brastad from Kristiansand, Norway, who is a teacher, awesome, got lots of respect for you guys. He also recently moved into his newly built house and it was always a dream for him to have a dedicated room. So he made sure pre-building plans of the house was spot on, which includes extra acoustic treatment, ventilation and wiring. He's running a full 7.1.4 DALI surround sound setup, starting off with the screen we have the 106 inch Grandview Edge 16.9 fixed screen, looks awesome. For left and right front channels he's using the master of music, the exceptional DALI Opticon 6 floor standing speakers, paired with the DALI Opticon focal center speaker. This combination looks amazing. Aslak has wall mounted his surround channels, which are the Dali Altica C1 speakers. These are truly multi-purpose speakers. You can use them all around the room in many different ways. Finishing his surround rear channels, we have the wall mounted high-end series Dali Zenso 1 speakers, creating immaculate sound and matching the classy look with his four channel Dolby Atmos Dali Phantom E80 ceiling speakers. These high-end puppies are equipped with not six, but eight inch woofers and pump up to 150 watts of power. For hard thumping bass, he's hooked up the award-winning legacy product, the high quality Arundel Sound 1723 1.5 subwoofer. Wow, this thing is literally on steroids. This 500 watt sub delivers massive performance on movies with real attention to detail. His complete surround sound is being powered by the remarkable 9-channel NAD T787 receiver, which is also paired with the NAD CI 940 multi-channel amplifier powering his four Dolby AMA speakers. 
I love these things, such high quality solid amplifiers. In the middle back of the room on this gorgeous IKEA bureau shelf, bureau shelf, however you want to pronounce that, is also got the PlayStation 4 Pro for gaming and 4K CDs, Apple 4K TV for streaming as well as the Sony UBPX 700 4K Blu-ray player and controls his complete setup with of course the famous Logitech Harmony Elite and his NAD controller. He's also a massive Game of Thrones fan and around the room he's got a growing collection of 4K and Blu-ray movies and managed to squeeze in this awesome looking model lounge that matches his theme. Last but not least, yes you guessed that, check out this 4K Pro Ultra HD Epson EHTW9400 projector. Yes it's the same projector as the Room Tour number one on this video. They are amazing projectors, not only because it's quality and insanely crystal clear pictures, but having the ability to shift screen lens ratios from 16.9 to 235.1 with a touch of a button is just magic. Amazing technology. Aslak plans to add some smart RGB lighting for some cool effects around the room, cover the side window properly with some potential blinds or curtains and add another subwoofer to his setup. If you guys have any suggestions for him, feel free to drop a comment in the section below. I'm going to wrap this up for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. And if you have any questions about these amazing three rooms, shoot a comment down below. I love making these tour videos for you guys, but give me some honest feedback if you like. I'd love to hear them. And as always, I'll try to list all these items for you guys in the description box. So check it out if you're interested. I would also put a link of an awesome online store for home theater and general tech gear. They're awesome and have amazing prices. I'm Sarkis, you can catch me on my Instagram, HStudio3.0, on future upcoming videos and hopefully some giveaways in the near future. Take care and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.